What's going on everybody? We're hanging out in St. Louis today among the sounds of all of those cicadas. But well, we've made ourselves the crustacean stuffed bacon wrapped onion ring on the smoker. Let me show you how it's done. All right, my friends, it is time to build our Crustacean Delight onion ring. So we just went through that speed round of some of the things we're making for this process, but now we'll slow it down and show how we're going to mix things together. So got that cream cheese that came off of that smoker. Also have those shrimp. So we're going to take those shrimp. We're actually going to chop some of those up. And I'm going to take most of them. I'm going to save probably about two or three because I'm going to use those here in a moment for something different. All right, so we'll take those shrimp. We'll just chop those up into little pieces. And then once we're done with that shrimp, I can smell that seasoning on that shrimp as well. Holy cow, I forget how much I love that seasoning that we put on those. All right, so what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take up this chopped shrimp and simply use that pie pan that we've got that smoked cream cheese sitting in over here now that pie pan is probably still just a little bit hot that's yeah, not too bad so you can see that cream cheese in there even that little piece that fell off because we sliced it up that's okay so we're going to take our shrimp mixture here and we are going to go ahead and just put it on top of that cream cheese And then next, we're going to add just a little bit of some shredded cheese as well. So you're welcome to use whatever you want. I just got, I had a little bit of leftover Mexican cheese in the house, so we're just going to use that. But like I said, when we started this process, we are just throwing together some stuff today out here as we play within the noise of the cicadas. All right, so we're going to take this pan and we're going to mix things up with that spoon. Once we get things mixed just a little bit, we're actually gonna throw it back on the smoker only for about five to 10 minutes so that shredded cheese starts to melt inside of there as well. And then we will show you what we are going to do next, my friends. All right, friends, now we're gonna start putting all of these elements together. So I had made several of those bacon wrapped onion rings. so. That biggest one that I made right here on the bottom in the center of that plate. We're going to go ahead and take some of that cream cheese mixture with those shrimp and fill the center of that just a little bit. And then we'll take my next onion ring, sit it right across the top, almost giving it, almost looks like a volcano, so to speak. So we're going to continue to fill that as well. There's definitely some of this mixture left over, so we could go, you know what we're going to do? I got another onion ring. Let's, let me grab a paper towel. And let's go even one higher. Why don't, why don't we, my friends? All right, so we're going to go over here and grab one more onion ring off of that smoker. So right across the top as well. Look how high that is. We'll add some more of that mixture right in there. We'll press it down inside that onion ring. That shrimp. Holy cow, my friends. So 
we're going to continue to top this off just a little bit. We'll take a couple of those shrimp right on the top. And then last but not least, so crustacean theme here. I got some Zappos. They're spicy Cajun crawl taters potato chips. I'm going to open that bag, get the air out of there, and then I'm going to crunch them up just a little bit here. Let's see if you can hear that crunching over all the cicadas here in my backyard here in St. Louis today. All right, we got those broken up as well. Luckily, I am the only one eating this, so I can just do whatever I want. We'll just throw some of those chips across the top. It's okay if it gets a little sloppy here. And then we're going to top it off a little Blues Hog Championship blend. Excuse whatever aircraft is flying over right now. Oh, yeah. And there we go, my friends. We got ourselves our Crustacean Delight filled bacon wrapped onion ring. You know what? You can do anything you want. Just get creative on that backyard smoker. Think of the things you might have left over in the fridge, in the freezer, in your cabinet. It doesn't matter. Put things together. Get creative at home. That's hopefully what you were inspired to do with today's recipe. I'll make sure I put all you need to know in the description below. If you like what we're doing here, make sure you hit subscribe, hit the like button, share it with your friends. We really appreciate all of our viewers. We'll see you guys again on Bones and Bruce.